In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up your job layout. To do this, I'm going to right click on my job and go to settings. This will then open our job settings window and the first tab is layout. The first thing I always do on this is I press my get media width button and that will pull the printer for the size of our media. So in this instance, I've got 1346.20 of media width to use. We then have our job on the right hand side. As you can see, it puts it to the zero, zero point of our, of our media. So this is our starting point towards the panel side of our printer. This top edge here is the first edge that will be printed. With my job, the first thing I can do is my scaling, so I can increase the size of my job here. So I could go to 200% here, and it will incre increase the job. I can also do this by width, and as you can see, it automatically updates the other value, so it will never take it out of ratio. I can also fit my job to my media size here. The next thing I can do is I can center my job on media, or I can position it using my millimeters here. So I can bring it across using my X axis, and I can bring my job down using my Y axis. The other thing we can do is you can just pick the job up and you can move it to where you want it to go. Below there we have our print properties. This is our copies, so I'm just make it a little bit bigger. You'll see if I add copies, it adds them across the page. I can also type in the amount that I want and it will add the copies for me. In here we can also do tile spacing. And it will find obviously the best arrangement for your job as well to utilize the, the smallest possible media. If I remove my copies, make my job a little bit bigger. You'll also see I've got my mirror function. So if I was printing this on a clear vinyl and I wanted it to go on the other side of a window, I can mirror this job and then back it with white. And I could also change the orientation of my job as well. So using these keys here, I can change the job around and turn it around on my page. This may help if you're trying to fit more jobs onto the page. Once we've done this, we can press OK, and that will save those settings that you've just changed. 